Hi everyone, welcome to Dash Crow Pro. It's Rezo right out here, and I will help you kill coronavirus. So we have here a 2018 4x4 Mitsubishi Strada. A tough car for a tough man, but not tough enough if you have a virus inside. The whole world right now is battling against this coronavirus. Well, since we're quarantined right now and don't have an access to mga detailing shop, so a friend of mine asked me to do this video on how to disinfect your vehicle. Thank you again, Brother Brian, for your suggestion. He's from uh, the Lost Boys PH and thinks this is a kappa. Pretty nice. Okay, so to start, I'm not a doctor nor a chemist. Ha? This is somewhat new to me and of course, I believe sa inyo rin. So I did my own research kung ano mga recommendations ng DOH and World Health Organization on how to disinfect. Sabi nga sa, ano, sa World Health Organization, the virus is transmitted through a little droplets ng liquids. So in which vehicles natin are very prone kasi paano ba natin mga paandar yan, di ba? So kailangan natin hawakan yung manobela, the gear knobs, and everything to operate this uh, safely. So kailangan talaga siyang dis disinfect. That's one uh, thing na pwede natin makontribute sa community. Okay? So ano ba yung mga dapat natin gamitin? Sige. Uh, let's check this out. So before I start, I would like to invite you to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click that notification button below. And also, we have, uh, please follow our Instagram and Facebook page to check the latest Dashcar Pro cars for sale. Okay, so start na tayo. So ang gagawin natin ngayon is two steps lang. Ang gagawin natin is, we will clean the interior of the vehicle and we will disinfect. Ano ba yung difference ng ano? cleaning, sanitizing, and disinfecting? Explain ko lang quickly. So cleaning, ang ginagawa niya is literally cleaning. So dinatanggal niya yung mga dirt sa surfaces. Sanitizing, nilo-lower down mo lang yung, ano, yung mga viruses and dirt. But hindi niya natutotally kill yung mga viruses like the coronavirus. But if you disinfect, 100%. Pinapatay niya yung virus. But you have to check first na sa, sa chemicals na i-apply nyo. Since nga, ang things lang natin sa house is limited. So, I'm encouraging you to check yung label ng ano nyo. Disinfectant. Kung meron kayong disinfectant, better. If wala, maging resourceful na lang. You check kung ano, yung, ano ba yung mga available sa bahay natin. One dyan is the bleach. May example ako dito. Kunin ko lang. So, very popular itong bleach na to. Um, Pag-check ko sa label niya, yeah, kasama sa uh, mga viruses na kaya niyang patayin is the coronavirus. However, pag-try ko kanina dun sa isang car, uh, nagkaroon siya ng, ano, ng white stains. So, dinidiscourage ko to use this uh, bleach kasi nga, it would hurt the interior of the vehicle. So, yun yung na-observe ko kanina. So, ksh, ksh, no na dito. Okay, another one nga dyan is Lysol. Very popular then to disinfect. However, same result na nangyari. Nagkaroon din ng white stains yung interior ng vehicle natin. Particularly sa plastic. I tried din kanina. Yun nga, ganun din nangyari. So, discourage ko rin the Lysol. Hindi maganda effect nga niya sa interior ng vehicle natin. Yun. So, nag-check pa ako sa bahay ko ano yung mga available. And, chine ko tong ano, Pine Sol. Actually, hindi ko nga alam yung brand na tayo. But, uh, Pag-apply ko sa kanilang tatlo, ito lang yung ano, ito lang yung hindi nag-iwan ng, ano, ng mga marks sa interior ng vehicle. So, ito yung gagawin, gagamitin natin ngayon. Yung tip ko dyan is, try nyo sa ano, sa ilalim ng uh, sidings nyo, yung hindi masyadong kita. Doon mo lang itry yung mga disinfectant na chemicals. Then, see kung ano, leave it, siguro mga 5 to 10 minutes. Then, see kung may discoloration na mangyayari. And kung ano yung mas better, yung walang discoloration, yun gamitin niya. Okay? Since nga limited tayo eh, limited yung mga gamit na sa bahay. Plus naka-quarantine pa. Sometimes, us here sa probinsa, we go out lang once every five days. So, if you need na mag-disinfect soon, so, kailangan natin maging resourceful. Okay, so things to use not to disinfect your vehicle. Okay? So, we ha I have here an empty container. Um, also, I have the disinfectant 
yung I've shown earlier. And I have one car cleaner. Kung anong, kahit anong car cleaner na favorite na will do. My a pair of gloves. We need to protect our skin, di ba? From harmful chemicals. Okay, so we have microfiber cloth here. Dalawang piraso. One is pang linis. Then the other one is pang ano, pang wipe out. Plus the brush. Kung dun sa mga hard surfaces na kailangan yung gamitan ng brush. Okay, so let's start na this is the first step natin, which is cleaning. Don't forget to wear your gloves. Kailangan natin protektahan yung balat natin eh. From those harmful chemicals. Diba? Simple cleaning lang yung gagawin natin ngayon ha. Hindi ko napapakita yung ano, yung pang OC type ng pag-clean ng headliners, pag-clean ng sidings and everything. Simple cleaning lang gagawin natin ngayon. Followed by the second step, which is the, the disinfecting. Meron akong six hot spot ng interior for the vehicle na kailangan nating uh, linisan ng mabuti. Number one dyan for me is the steering wheel. Sabi nga ng mga popular detailing shop dyan, mas marumi pa to kaysa sa, kaysa sa toilet seats nyo. So yeah, better clean it perfectly kaysa maadumihan yung kamay natin or ma magkaroon tayo ng virus or mag mag magkaroon dyan ng mga bacteria. Okay, second sa list ko sa hot spot na kailangan nating i-disinfect and i-clean is the door handles, um, exterior and interior. Lahat yan. So, sa, sa driver's side and sa passenger, so linisin natin yung mga door handles na yan. Uh, number three sa list ko is the seat belts. Yeah, kasi lagi na yung natin hinahawakin eh. Then number four is the stereo, AC, and sa sa engine start, start button, kung naka-push start yung engine mo. Okay, so yan mga things na yan. Number five is the shift knob or sa cambio. And uh, lastly, the handbrakes. Yan. Well, some of the vehicles, ang handbrake nila, ano eh, uh, operated by pedal. Like uh, CRV, yung old CRV. Pero yung mga new ones naman, push button na rin. Okay? So yun yung mga sixth hot spot ng, ng vehicle mo na kailangan nating i-clean and disinfect. Okay? So, simulan na natin yung cleaning. Okay, start na tayo ng pag-clean ng interior for vehicle. Okay, kuno mo lang yung favorite cleaner mo. Uh, now, ano mong ginagamit ko? Armor all and your microfiber na cloth. Ang ginagawa ko sa pag naglilinis ako ng interior ng sasakyan eh, sinisimulan ko siya from top to bottom. Okay? So, uh, first, linisan yung headliners, then pababa, okay? So, pag-apply ng, ano, ng cleaner mo, um, spray, spray mo lang siya sa cloth, generous amount para mas effective. Huwag niyong spray directly sa, ano, sa surface. Sometimes kasi matapang yung cleaner, then nagkakaroon siya ng, ano, ng discoloration, okay? Simulan natin sa taas. Yan, so, lang sa headliners, sakto. Maliit yung headliners itong ano, pick-up. Okay. Yan, yung scenes lang. Yan. So, again ha, yung mga hot spots, yun yung linisan natin ng ano, properly. Okay. Kahit doble pasada, ah, mga hot spots. Ito pa, one more tip. Mga kadash car pro tips. Um, I highly encourage you to do this indoor. Okay? Or if wala tayong ano, uh, indoor garage, I would suggest you to do this early in the morning or late afternoon. Kasi uh, we want to avoid nga yung direct sunlight at saka yung mainit. Kapag mabilis kasi matuyo yung ano, yung cleaner nyo and uh, ano, disinfectant. So, again, you want to avoid yung mga discoloration ng interiors. We maintain yung, ano, yung aesthetics ng interior ng vehicle natin. Also, focus kayo sa kung ano yung mga madalas natin hinahawakan sa interior. Like yung mga itong handles. Ayan, doble linis. Ang cleaning is we eliminate yung mga dirts, but we're not killing the viruses. So, kaya ito yung first step. Binabukasan lang natin siya. Mga tumi and yung virus. Tapos, sa part 2, disinfect natin. We will kill the COVID-19 or other mga, or other viruses na nasa vehicle natin. Tapos, sa may mga, ano, 
like sa stereo, sa AC, uh, gently lang or medyo konti lang yung ano niya, yung cleaner no. Yan. Kasi sensitive siya kasi yeah, mga electrical stuff. There. Sa mga vents, um, gamitin siya ng brush para yung mga unreachable na parts malinis. Okay? Malinis siya. Then, do not forget to wipe it clean ng microfiber cloth nyo. Okay? So, magkaiba. Meron kang pang ano, uh, palinis. Tapos ito yung pang wipe mo. Then, the steering wheel. Ayun siya, kahit five times. Para mas malinis. To eliminate mo yung mga germs. Ayan. The shift knob. Ito, madali lang linisan to. Handbrakes. Turi-turi nyo lahat, linisan nyo. Hindi lang sa driver side, pati passenger. Um, do not forget din to, ano, to vacuum and clean your ano, uh, mga mattings. Kasi yun yung mga part na marunumi talaga. Okay? But, we'll proceed na to disinfecting. Okay? Kunin ko na yung mga ano, gamit natin. Okay. Mag-start na tayo to disinfect. Ito nga pala yung finished product natin. Okay? So, yan. Ginamit ko lang yung old container. Tapos dito ko lalagay yung finished product ng disinfectant. Okay? Sabi dito sa directions, to produce a liter of uh, disinfectant, kailangan ko magdagdag ng 20 ml of this product to a liter of water. So, so very important to read yung directions, okay? Kung ano yung um, recommended nila, yun lang gagawin nyo. Also, very important then to read kung anong directions to use, okay? In this product kasi, sabi niya, to disinfect or to totally clean the virus, kailangan mong i-leave yung surface up to 5 minutes after mong um, punasan siya with, with the disinfectant. Okay? 5 minutes for this product. Another option pala here is to uh, sanitize. Kailangan mo lang siyang iwan for a minute. 1 minute lang. Sanitize na yung surface ng vehicle mo. Okay? Pero since nga ang goal natin is to disinfect or to kill that virus, we'll leave the surface na merong disinfectant for 5 minutes para totally clean. Wala lang COVID. Para makalabas na tayo ng bahay natin and continue our uh, lives. Yung normal lives natin, okay? So, let us disinfect and kill the virus. Okay, same ano lang. Same, same lang. Again, mas harmful to, ah. Mas medyo harmful to sa interior ng vehicle mo. So, um, huwag masyadong marami. Enough, enough lang uh, para malinis yung vehicle mo. So, ang gagawin, gagawin lang natin ngayon is we will disinfect yung mga hot spots ng car kasi medyo matapang talaga siya. Okay? So, simula ko dito sa ano, steering wheel. Ayan. Ayan. Pagbaga sa vitamins, double dose, no? Ito sa hot spot. Ayan. At ang hot spot, ilang muna lalagyan natin ng disinfectant. Work at saka ano to, ah, workout na rin. Ito yung pawis ko. Yeah! <laughs> Kailangan natin maging fit. Especially ngayong quarantine, wala tayong masyado ginagawa. Um, again, leave it for 5 minutes uh, para mag full, mag full effect yung ano natin, yung pag disinfect, okay? As prescribed nga dun sa directions ng manufacturer ng disinfectant, okay? So after 5 minutes, iwa wipe clean natin siya, okay? Murasa nyo na. Okay, 5 minutes over. Okay, so punasan lang natin. Ayan, wipe it clean. Kita nyo, di ba? Walang discoloration or anything else. And, paktay. Paktay ka diha. <laughs> Patay yung virus na, yung COVID-19 yan. Nilinis lang. Yan lang yan. Nilinis lang. 
So uh, we're done uh, with cleaning and disinfecting the vehicle natin. Okay? So yeah, nakakapagod. Pero siguro mga if you have an hour of your time free, um, I encourage you to do this. We all know naman na yung mga uh, medical uh, leaders natin is still searching for the vaccine or antidote dito sa coronavirus. Important then if we have best practices. Okay, so I encourage you to always wash your hands at least 20 seconds para at least ma-sanitize and disinfect yung kamay nyo. Matagal yung mga viruses na yan. Next is, uh, better na magbound ka ng ano, at least 60% alcohol inside of your vehicle. Para at least uh, kailangan mo lumabas, um, at least you're protected. And kapag galing nga sa public areas, bago ka pumasok ng car, um, spray mo lang yung ano, alcohol sa hands mo. And encourage sa shoes mo din. Okay? Better din na meron kang mask sa loob ng car para at least uh, anytime na kailangan mo siya, you can just wear it. Okay? And a pair of gloves sa loob ng vehicle. Okay? Turo ko lang pala sa inyo kung properly magtanggal ng, ano, ng gloves. It's very important din kasi nga possible meron mga viruses dyan na bubuhay yan. And take note, sabi nga sa World Health Organization, yung virus na yan, pwede siya mabuhay up to 72 hours sa uh, surfaces. Sa road, sabi nila, 9 hours. So, uh, kailangan talaga natin maging extra careful. Okay? So, pagtanggal ng, ano, ng gloves, pinch nyo lang here, hila, then bumaliktad siya. Ha? Uh, yan. Sila. Tapos, dun naman sa kabila, um, lusot mo lang yung kamay mo dito. I-avoid mong mahawakan yung external, yung labas ng gloves, di ba? Then, pull off. Ayan, tapos hawakin mo na yung galing sa loob. Ayan. Ayan. Uh, avoid lang na mahawakan mo yung ng external, yung labas ng gloves, okay? Then dispose it properly. So, I think that's it. I hope you find this video helpful. And rest assured that I will continue my research kung paano may improve pa uh, ang pag-disinfect ng vehicle natin. And I will check more products na pwede natin maghamit sa vehicle. So, I am encouraging you guys to follow the recommendations of DOH and World Health Organization. Okay? Stay at home. Practice social distancing and you will save lives. Okay? So, let's just pray na this pandemic will end soon. Para makaresume na tayo sa, sa normal lives natin. Okay? So, again, thank you for watching. And uh, this is Renzo of Dashcar Pro, and I will see you on the road.